current current collection status including duplicate poses above and below and we got out the big guys gotta get out the big guys those two poor dudes carrying that box nowhere forever hell's about that box I can watch them carrying that box all day Then you got these right out to me. Not a toy specialist. And we got some marks. 60 millimeter astronauts. Undo the zoom immediately so we don't go in and out of focus as poorly. There's the uh, American flag guy. So we got two of him in white. I believe that's my first. Yep. That's my first scoop and sample bag guy in 60 millimeters at white. Looks like he could use a bath. Uh, here's a square scoop guy at 60 millimeter. All marks Apollo astronauts will feature this stamp on the bottom. Ash, can you see this? If that circle is plain, empty, bare, or has a different logo, it's a bootleg from Mexico. And some of those are nice. 1970 in Roman numerals. Uh, the white figures first debuted in the giant Martian landing place set, which... Kent Sprecher helped me date to 1977, although there is an alternate date of 1972 that's been discussed as well. Uh, my feelings on it, if, if, if there's a theory to have, it would be that Lewis Marks helped design the giant Martian landing playset in 1972, just before he sold the company, because it is very nice compared to the later two. And the, Either they held on to it until 1977, or after he sold it, they just decided not to put it in production until Star Wars made a bundle of money. And then they had that one ready to go, and that's why it actually debuted in 1977. But the point is, is that Mark's Apollo astronauts will all have a 1970 date on the bottom because that was when the larger figures were uh, patented for 1970. There's the exact same nomenclature there. Uh, although, having read what I have of, about Lewis Marx and his devotion to his company, these were on sale by Christmas 1969. The 1970 date is, is like Hot Wheels, you know, they, pressing their car, having it be a 2019 but it, on, the, on the chassis, but it actually uh, streets in 2020, something like that. I'm pretty sure these were on sale by Christmas uh, soon after Apollo 11 landed the whole world was just enamored with it and by the way as long as we're here check out how his this is the sample bag and scoop guy look at his chest unit look at his chest unit They're a little bit different aren't they but if we look at his chest unit it's the same as his chest unit his bands look a little narrower don't they those look a, those look a little bit further apart and he doesn't have any at all. I haven't gone through the uh, smaller figures yet to to uh, scout them out. Here's Walker from uh, Point Blank, Lee Marvin Walker. He's just walking and walking and walking. And I'm delighted to now have a Walker, a small Walker in white. Uh, all sorts of fun things can be done with uh, perspective using photography. All right now this figure is interesting because he's a white ring hand figure meant to carry this uh, box. How's about that box? All over for, for all eternity. I wanted to see if they just simply made a ring 
it made the hand into a ring hand, or is it a, is it a different sculpt? Well, since the ring hander's opposite leg is forward, it's a different sculpt. Although I've read in a couple of places that the way that the artist made these forms that the that the figures were based on was in a modular way, where the the bodies were interchangeable, the heads were interchangeable, they were all the same. They just changed the the positioning of his legs and stuck a ring hand on. And I'd give him a turn at carrying the box here, but I'm, I'm concerned about things breaking, you know. I'm, if anyone's going to break them, it's going to be me. So Mark's Toys, Apollo Astronauts in 6 inch and 60 millimeter form. Uh, and the last one I need for to, to complete my collection is a white lunchbox guy or suitcase guy. I guess that's bigger than a lunchbox. That's more like a suitcase. You know, I think about it in terms of a of, of, you know, kid. So here's, here's a guy with his suitcase, and he's going to grandma's for the night. And I'm going to bag these back up. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.